Good evening, good afternoon, and good morning. My name is Frozen Island, and today we're we'll doing a bit more of our Rogue Arena run. So we actually are three and zero this deck, so we're actually doing quite well. So I am kind of waiting for that one deck again that kind of just flattens us. But anyway, oh, let's jump in. Okay. Mage this time round. Um. Two, technically a three drop. Toss that anyway, because I may do I want it early? No, because I'd rather have something else. That's a good five drop, so I'll keep it. This is being a bit greedy here. Because I'm expecting to get another four drop from my deck, or like another like, couple of two drops in between things. And we'll just kind of play things out from there. There's no point in me coining here, I don't want to do that. So here we'll just play the two mana card. So a three mana play is probably not going to be able to do anything. Which means they play nothing or they actually play something. And it dies. So either way is good for me. Straight up die is cool. I know it is, isn't it? So here I'm going to play my 1-mana card, dagger that down. Eh, we don't get it. We don't have a choose one spell in my deck, so it's kind of pointless. I'm trying to save the coin there for uh, anything else. I hope this fits on the ship. So here I will. Uh, Use the three damage coin. Turn that down. Keep hold the dagger. Hopefully, we do get a dragon to come into hand. Would be quite nice for next turn. If not, we got our five mana drop anyway. But my opponent seems very talkative, meaning they probably got a lot of sort of like really good value cards or like game cards. So we might want to just uh, hold back a small amount if we're able to. Just play the 5 mana drop. We'll hit that, take off the Divine Shield. There's no point in me hitting it with the 3 3 because, one, they'll ping my minion down, which okay, does give me tempo, but they still get the 2 damage on the 5 6 anyway, if I do that. So there is kind of no point. And if they don't kill it off, I still have to take another 2 damage. So this way kind of makes them want to play a quicker answer. You know, maybe they might make another mistake or something. Do you hear so, deal three damage, summon a shark with rush. It's not bad, and it does trade off one and the other, so that's what we'll do. But I'm thinking they got flame strike here, if the ping went on that. So. I'm going to play a little bit differently because of that. Using the poisonous there because I think the flame strike is coming or something like that, and all these die to flame strike, but they're dead to other stuff as well, or yeah. the other cards in general anyway, so it makes no difference, and I didn't really want to kind of sort of force stuff out here. But this is quite a good card for next turn, I get to kill that off, and then sh basically kill something else off if I need to. And we get the rush as well if we need as well on that, so... Actually, is the rush any better here? Not really, it doesn't get off this stuff quick enough, so I'm going to kill that. This dies anyway to both of those, so I'll keep the health on my minion more. 
I will use the rush here because I feel like it's a lot better that way rather than using the extortion just because I want to try again get as much value as I want my cards I can So that's kind of fine here. We just use this. You have no idea, friend. We're literally just going to outvalue you because of this now. It's just one of those things where it's just funny that the opponents just still think like, oh yeah, let's do this play here. Um, here I will use the extortion. Let's kill that off. Um, we'll play the three mana card. It does gain one attack, so it's a 3-2. It's about as good as it's going to be at the moment anyway. Well, a 10 mana card now as well, after all their plays. Like they have an actual mech deck, that's what kind of is silly about it. Uh, we'll use this here. Playing this down doesn't do anything. Got some inevitability on there. They probably still got some sort of ball clear. But they've been playing all the cards they had in hand out, and they haven't really kind of got anything else at the moment. So, apart from any unforeseen circumstances, we should have this game in the lock. Um, I am going to trade this in here first. Okay. And not point playing any of those. We'll play this one. Yeah. I don't have any more dragons, so I'll just play this out. Yeah, copy of the top card. So now they've got, they've got a spark drill in hand, which is what they're going to use here. You really shouldn't have used that there. Well played. Thank you. Thank you. you win. But there we go. That is the game. Four and zero of this deck is... Don't really know how we're doing it, to be honest. But I said that game just goes to show that kind of just playing really well, taking good value trades, and just making sure that we're not kind of overextending something that would be a little bit more unusual. And I think my opponent kind of blew their combo that they had a little bit early, especially the amount of mech cars they had in hand. I mean, it was absolutely ridiculous. But anyway, if you do enjoy the video, do leave a like, subscribe to see more, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.